Hey everybody, Gamerin with the GameCube here, and we're playing some more Subnautica. Today, oh, oh, daybreak, we're going to have a very exciting adventure. We're going to go all the way over to the, um, that weird shadow. We're going to investigate that thing. Um, before I do that, I actually want to try to make a battery, maybe? Just need some ash mushrooms, we can go grab some of those. Um, because the sea glide, oh, we should also deposit this chunk, um, uh, seems to run out of battery kind of quick, um... So if that happens while we're on the road, so to speak. Uh, man, wow, we, we filled that up fast, didn't we? Okay. Um, I'd basically like to to have another battery for emergency purposes. Plus, uh, there's kind of a lot of traveling involved. Okay, and I don't think... Oh, we do have a peeper. Let's do it. So, we'll munch on a peeper, drink some water, get all fully... Every time. <laughs> get all full up on our uh, stats there, and we'll go, we'll go for a swim. Because we're investigating... Oh, maybe we can't see it. Is, it. is that the direction I want to go? It's sort of interesting, because there's like a cloud bank. It didn't seem to really move. Maybe it was that one? Well... Yeah, I bet you it was, because here's a little life pod 17. Real close to the base, actually. I wonder why it took so long for its message to get out here. Oh. Should grab some uh, food to go. Boomerang, wait! I've chosen you! Alright. Once again, onward. What? I'm not even sure I'm going the right direction. Well, nothing like exploring anyway. More microwaves. Two microwaves, matter of fact. These will probably be ones we don't need, but... What is this? Bioreactor fragment? Yep. And this guy? Bioreactor fragment. Negative. Negative. Oh, but there's one way down there. Can we get it? Do we have enough air? Propulsion cannon. Oh, yeah. So I guess these are um, based on like where you find them. Oh, hello, speedfish. Uh, and this is like the blood kelp sort of biome. Look, there's two more microwaves right here. Propulsion cannon again. We should see what this one is before we uh, go up for air really fast. Blueprint acquired. Because if it's propulsion cannon. Modification station. Oh. Look, there's another one. Well, she can't. Okay. Okay, let's get out of here. What is that? Well, we'll find out soon. This is very exciting. Man. This is a big biome, actually. Whoa! I see you there, guy. Mm -hmm. i keep my eye on you when I go back down. Mm -hmm. What is this? What is this? Supposed to have the old sea glide. We made an extra battery for a reason. Whoa, that is much faster. Seamoth fragment? Whoa! Yes, please. Five of them. Oh man. Find five seamoths. Oh, that's a propulsion cannon, isn't it? Okay. This is neat though. Whoa, looks like a pack of evil fishes. Found some salt. There's another thingy. What? Yeah? Well, aha! Modification station, yes! He's coming right for me! Class steel tank. Oh man, we're gonna we're gonna want to look into those pretty much ASAP. Okay, blueprint acquired. I also think this isn't exactly the right direction to uh to go to the other thing we we're trying to get to. That shadowy sort of island thing that we had seen. Propulsion cannon. Negative. Caution. Right, let's go 30 quick. seconds of oxygen remaining. Meow. Alright. Really, it's hard to tell. I do think... Yeah, it's definitely that. You can see now. Okay. Let's do it. Well, let's bust out the old sea glide. Burn through a bit of energy. Oh man, look at the depth on this thing, it just doesn't even know. 
Can't see the bottom. We've got a destination in mind. Ooh, nice and bright over here. Whoa. So deep. Definitely feel better with this sea glide here. Should take another peek up top. Whoa. That's a thing, all right. Oh, I think that's showing us is that a sec secondary battery in our inventory there, or is it just a battery indicator showing that that is our power on the right-hand side? Unknown. Wow, land. Oh, and there's th things on the land. Like, what is this? What is that? I don't suppose we'll find out, huh? No? Oh, whoa, it's floating. Man, I'll tell you one thing. Just having nothing but ocean beneath me is, uh, give me a little bit of the heebie jeebies. Like, what's down there? It's just nothing. It's sort of like a scared of height sensation. What is all this? Whoa, what are you? Can I find out? Can I scan you? Come here, critter. You are a cave crawler. Whoa, are you friendly or mean? I can't tell. Okay, cave crawler entry edit. Maybe. Maybe you are mean, maybe you are not. Pink flower. They seem more or less, more or less harmless. Okay. Maybe just frolicking. Orange petals plant. Can I like get these, interact with these? Wow, what is going on with this stuff? Bulbo tree. This appears to be a weeping bulbo tree over here. Ugh, some sort of secretions. Should I put that away? Yeah. So it seems to be lots of stuff. Ooh, I can actually get this. Pink mushroom. I will pick a pink mushroom. I don't know what it does, but I have picked it. Great. And I've added it to my encyclopedia. They have pink mushrooms and orange mushrooms. Uh, uh huh. I really don't know if that does anything. Scanning stuff. Oh, I'm definitely gonna want to go up there though. How can we get up there? There seems to be this sort of path. Yeah, there's definitely a couple things. Oh, hello. Oh, oh, I took my fins off. Interesting. Whoa. Whoa, what is this? Ooh, hanging fruit. Hanging fruit tree. Get to scan all the things because I can. Should we get some hanging fruit? What is, uh. Is that something we can do anything with? I can eat that. Whoa, look at that water. <sighs> nice. You can eat these? No, no, I can't eat these. They do something. Wow, that is a really fidgety, um, watch me once it. I'm going to grab another one of those for the road. There seems to be plenty. Cool. Now this is very interesting. Like, okay, so this looks like this is a multi-purpose room, right? Oh, there's a critter in there. Oh, what is this? Exterior grow bed. What? Oh. Okay, so you can, you can get stuff. Small marble melon. Purple vegetable. I can pick it. I can't scan that one. I can't scan that one. So maybe scanning flora and fauna doesn't do too much, unless I desire to eat them. Whoa, desk. Whoa, I can scan the desk.
It's a desk, bro. I don't know. Uh, I don't know what's so difficult about it. Okay, so yes. Living wall? Apparently, you can scan this too. Okay, they seem friendly. Oh, I was gonna say they seem friendly, but they don't seem friendly at all! Oh, where'd he go? Where'd you go, you son of a bitch? Come here, come here. Get some. Oh, he's kicking my butt. Can you kill these things? Yes, you can. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know if that's just because I was hanging around so much. Oh, you don't lose your progress. That's nice. Okay. Um. Yes. PDAs. Data bank. Data downloads. Degasi survivors. Voice log. Between Paul and Bat. And Medea. And the CPU. Oh man, this seems like some sort of sinister goings on. Okay, I cannot get through that way. Spotlight. Yes, please. Oh, do you see what I see? I see a cargo container up there. Do you see? Do you see it up there? We gotta find a way. Wow, spotlight indeed. Aquad. Can I uh, do a little parkour here? Oh, maybe we're supposed to go up that way. Oh, whatever. Ah. Excuse me. Oh, and a ladder we can go down. But first, supply crate, first aid kit. Oh, thank goodness. Thank goodness we found a first aid kit. Ah, no? What? Battery? I like batteries. Batteries are great. Can we go out here? Can I scan a bulkhead? Scan the door? Ooh, another one. Oh, this is perhaps maybe the first one. I'm Paul Torgal, Chief Executive Officer of the Torgalian Corporation. My crew and I were marooned here five weeks ago when our ship was struck by some kind of weapon. We constructed a habitat and using materials reclaimed from the ship. We survived by cultivating indigenous flora. The biochemistry imprint I commissioned for my son has already paid for itself. He has grown enough food to last us a month. Uh, I would also like to grow food. That sounds great. Now I fear for our safety. A mercenary I hired for the journey, Mar Marguit. Maida is increasingly disturbed. She insists we abandon the site and establish a habitat underwater. Why? Just because there's so much of it? I fear she may take steps to sabotage her habitat here to enforce her own agenda. Nonetheless, against, and against my better judgment, I have acquiesced to a request for a scout for a suitable aquatic site. Interesting. But now this looks like it's been here for just forever. My hope is she will quickly realize how unforgiving the ocean is and abandon this foolish ambition. Did you build a second base instead? Should we go try to find out? More about their second base? That oh, sounds like a great idea. I'd love to do that. Um, terrain navigation somewhat questionable. Oh, what are you? Hot peppers? Whoa! Look at that view. Oh, Aurora. Not doing so hot. Uh, some trees. I don't know if we're going the right direction or not. Maybe, sort of. What is this? Purple rattle. Should I scan the purple rattle first? I feel like I should scan the purple rattle first. Oh, what if stuff comes out at night? It's not something I really thought about. This just seems to go back to the first one. Do I just double back on myself? Yeah, maybe. Should we off-road it? Off-road it a little bit? An additional purple rattle? Let's see what the purple rattle is like in our inventory. Well, it's purple rattle, all right. Okay. Sort of. Yeah, here seems to be a path. This is not a very habitable area you fellows found. Probably had calf muscles like nobody's business. All this climbing. Only the vaguest of paths. Yes? I've got to jump just to get around someplace. Oh, is that my shadow? Is that some other creature? Man! Oh, there's another one. So, okay, so there's the two mountaintop ones. And there's like a middle one in there. Okay. Oh. Wow, wow. Whoa. That's pretty amazing. Alright. What's in here? 
What? Okay. <laughs> Disinfected water. That sounds cool. Abandoned pitta. Preparing for the day's water ration ahead of time will help ensure against dehydration and eventual death. Okay. Yeah, that sounds good. Is that, uh, yeah, 40 water instead of 20 water. Nice. I wonder if I can scan that. Can I drop that with the right mouse button? There, see, I did it on purpose, but then I didn't do that on purpose. Can I scan the disinfected water? Will that teach me how to make disinfected water? I can probably make disinfected water already. Maybe. Indoor grow bread. Observatory fragment. Huh. Okay. I'm all about them blueprints. And acquiring them. Man, you know what we can do? Indoor grow bed. Great. I wonder if we can, um... Fern palm. I wonder if we can plant this stuff at our house and have fruit for forever. Because eating fish is all well and good. But you're going to need to... Uh, Need some vitamins at some point. I already scanned that, right? How many of these can we get? Maybe one more? Yeah, that was it. So I wonder if we can plant these. Old hanging fruit. Oh, okay. So I wonder if it matters. We should probably head back soon. Actually, we should probably eat this old hanging fruit. And grab a fresh hanging fruit. Huh? Yeah. Because they don't provide a whole lot, but... I mean, if that's one tree, that's, uh, that's pretty good. Is there anything else here? Wow, super neat. That is, it's very weird. It's like a, a jump platform. Is there is there actually a thing here that's doing that, or is it just... Yeah, it's like the spotlight. No, not when I do it on purpose. Sort of. Wow, that... Maybe a bit dangerous. Okay, let's, let's stop doing that. <laughs> Man, should we try for that last one? I feel like we must, you know. We've come so far. Plus, it's still nighttime. Swimming around at night. Oh, neat. Swimming around at night does not sound like the best idea. All these weird plants. How does one get up here? I feel like I feel like the path is over here. Yep, sure enough. Whoa, are you a tree I can scan? Vine tree? Do I make ropes out of you? Swiss Family Robinson style? See that? Yeah. The little ledge had nothing on me. Oh, do I go through or do I go up? Yep, pink mushrooms, we know all about those. Ooh, that was scary. A little bit of clipping. Man, this is a steep cliff. We'll go through this one. Aha. Uh -huh. Ah, sun's coming out. That's nice. Oh. Oh. <laughs> ah, texture's a little rough this far out. <laughs> Come on. This is clearly a pathway. Yes. Okay, another bounce pad. Check. We're going to avoid that. <gasps> what is this? Potted plant. Potted plant 2. This looks slightly different. Is that like a potted plant 1? A potted plant 2? What is in here? Purple vegetable. Small marble melon. Can I... I can pick up the small marble melon. Okay. Oh, I can eat that too. Man. Okay, this appears to be a also small pot too. Oh, a chair. We gotta have a chair to go with the desk. Great. And then finally... Log. No, voice log. Okay. Those are actually voices? Okay, no. No. Um, Torgal's voice log. Or regular log. Structured habitat. Okay. Visuals unidentified. Mm hmm. Okay.
Okay. Log number six. Messed up real bad this time. It's been two days since that what happened. We never should have left this island. I should have listened to them. We shouldn't have gone so deep. They don't want us down there. They don't trust us. I knew it. I didn't say. I could see it. And they couldn't. Now they're stuck down there, and I am up here alone. I deserve this. Whoa. Man. Man. Seems like a lot going on. All right, well. <laughs> I think we've had a lot of adventure. Should we try to make our way back, uh, back to the house? Maybe uh, we build up some of these things so we can, I don't know, put some down with these some marble melons and hanging fruit already old. Oh man, I hope it won't be bad by the time we get back. Probably should have hustled on that. I wonder if we can uh, get back down to like the beach and then pick up some fresh ones maybe? Or is that down over here? Yeah. Oh, it's getting dark again? Oh, because it's eclipse time. Good lord, it's dark. Time to bust out the old flashlight. I'm gonna break leg on the way back down. Can we get down this way? Oh, not quite. There we go. Wow. Neat. Oh, we're on the wrong side of the island though. Alright, so let's uh let's go ahead and eat these. Great. And then uh Pick three fresh ones. Yep. And then should we try to make our way to the other side of the island really fast? I feel like it shouldn't take too long. Just climb over the top right fast. Of course. I say that. Uh, almost. Yeah. Ooh, look at this. Nice little beach thing. Whoa. Cool. I bet there's another way into the island. Oops. <laughs> we might have to find out. Nah. I wonder if there's another beach on this side which we can have a little bit easier time of launching from. Yes. Sort of. Maybe. Not quite. Well, launching from certainly. Huh. Ploosh. All right, let's head on back. That was very exciting. Hopefully we can get back and then uh, scoop up the old homestead with some fresh fruit, some vegetables to go along with our high protein fish diet. Oh, it's so deep. So very spooky. Look at this. Power is dropping like a stone. Oh, there's our red, red water. It's probably above the uh, it blood kelp, blood moss biome, whatever it is. Oh wait, no! This is ever so slightly different. What is this? Let's get some air real fast. What is this? What are these weird things? Man. Oh man. So much strangeness. Oh depth. What's this? Inventory full. But what is it? Something I can pick up. Can we throw something away? Do we have any uh, titanium? Yeah, get out of here, Metal Savage. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, that scared me for a second, but of course it's just Metal Savage. Aluminum oxide crystal. Alright, neat. Salt? Salt deposit. We already know all about salt. Quartz? Okay. Well, we don't have any of these aluminum oxides, so we'll grab a couple of them. Let's hightail it to the surface now. Caution. 30 seconds of yep. oxygen yep. remaining. Yep, we're heading up. We're doing it. Okay, wow. That's cool. We'll have to explore this some more. Oh, I didn't really get a full full puff there, did we? Oh, I can't pass up free microwaves. Fire reactor. And then fire reactor. But this is another bioreactor, huh? Bioreactor, gosh. All 
All right, do we know where we are yet? Not quite. Yes, we do. There's the house. And Lucky Life Pod 17. Wonderful. Man, that was an exciting adventure. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you very much, robot. Mm -hmm. All right. So, wow. What do we got to do? We got to build these planters. Um, which also means we're going to have to do this. Let's do upstairs, shall we? Ladder. Um, no. Let, let, ladder? There we go. Okay. You know what? I don't have a inventory. I don't have any, uh, thingies. Appliances. Indoor grow bed. Titanium. Exterior grow bed. Pot plant. Hmm. I don't know what the difference is. We should grab some titanium from our titanium cabinet. Um, all two of them that we can fit right now. Aluminum oxide, we can put those in there. Grab two more titanium. Great. And then, indoor grow bed. Should we, uh, should put it right there? Wait. No, that's a terrible place. Can I deconstruct? Why is that a terrible place, you ask? Because, of course, that's where our uh, hallway is going to be. Oh, neat. Whoa, sure enough. Uh-huh. Can we plant all these things? Cool. I guess we'll just eat that one. It's already old. There's going to be two trees, though, theoretically. Oh, neat. I wonder how long it takes to grow. I wonder how big they get. Still, that's pretty neat. Should we put a window in here? We should put a window in here. Oh, my gosh. Let's put a window right there so we can get some, get some light in here. Anyway. Wow, neat. Okay, great. Super fun. Well, that was very exciting. We found an island, explored it, did all sorts of stuff. Um, found a new exciting biome with aluminum oxide stuff. I don't even know what that's all about, but we'll find out more next time. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the episode. It was a lot of fun. If you did, please do like, leave a like down below so we can uh, hear all about it, and we will catch you all next time.